Hello everyone and welcome back to section 7. How to implement stream grouping techniques in Apache Storm. So in this section we will go ahead and implement some stream grouping methods. We will be going ahead and understanding how to implement shuffle grouping, field groupings, all grouping, custom grouping as well as the direct grouping. So let's start with a little bit introduction on the types of groupings available in Apache Storm. So in this video, we'll go ahead and we'll see the need for the stream grouping and the different strategies of stream grouping. So typically, let's assume for a moment, this is the topology that you're executing, uh, which contains the number spout as well as the file writer blue bolt. So as you can see here very well that uh, we have only one instance of spout and we have one instance of bolt which is quite normal and the execution will work as normal. Uh, this is just a topology where I'm, I'm just writing a code to emit the numbers as it is and write the numbers in the file. But you know what? We can actually parallelize this operation. We can have multiple instances of bolts like this and we can ensure that we can utilize the power of our CPU to process the data faster in less amount of time. But the problem here is how to take charge on the tuples, how to ensure that the specific tuples goes to the specific bolt or something like that. Do we have any mechanisms for that? The answer to your questions is yes. We have something called as stream grouping strategies, which actually helps you out to decide or to make your program understand which directions the streams or the tuples must go, which bolt should accept which kind of stream. So in this entire section seven, we'll be actually discussing about different grouping strategies that we offer in Apache Storm.